Hey, Alex here with a quick tip on how to combine two channels of audio, like a left or a right channel from a synthesizer or some Eurorack gear, into a single stereo track inside of Ableton Live. So the first thing you're going to want to have is three audio channels, one for your left channel, one for your right channel, and then a third that's going to be set to no input that will be receiving both of the tracks of audio and combine them into the stereo. You're going to need to go ahead and arm all three of these tracks. You're going to want to make sure that the routing is set to output the left channel to the name of the third track down here. And same for the uh, right channel, we'll be going to the same uh, audio output track down here. You're going to want to hard pan all the way left on your left channel and likewise you're going to want to hard pan all the way right on your right channel and then you're going to want to make sure that all of your um, inputs are armed and we can go ahead and play an example that I have here set up from uh, one of my Eurorack modules called clouds it outputs a left and a right channel separately let's go ahead and hit record So from this we can see that we have our left channel and our right channel being combined into the third audio track down here. You can completely disable these tracks and show that it is indeed working. You might be wondering why this would be useful. Um, after all, we could just simply record into two adjacent inputs on our audio interface and uh, use a stereo input. However, when you're typically doing some complex signal routing um, and you're recording from a Eurorack module, or, uh, you might not have the inputs directly adjacent to each other, or maybe you've pre-recorded a separate left and right channel and you'd like to combine them uh, in post. Hopefully you found this tip useful.